Good morning, crochet friends. Pam here from Cozy Cuddles Crochet. I want to let you guys all see that I did finish the baby blanket yesterday that I had mentioned and asked for some help with the border choice. I went ahead and went with the chenille yarn for the border and I did four rounds of a single crochet on this blanket. And I just want to show you all the finished piece here. The blue stitch is the blanket stitch, or I've heard it called the Barkley stitch as well. But it came out gorgeous. Let me see if I can stand up here and show you the whole blanket and how big it really is. I just can't get it all in the, the screen here. But it came out gorgeous. It's it's bigger than a than a crib size, but I figured with being a baby blanket, he'll be able to use it for many years to come into the future. Also, I want to thank D over at D's Creative Hands for her live show last night, and with everybody being able to drop their channels. I am up to 102 subscribers. Today marks my two weeks since I have started doing this. So I do want to thank her and everybody over on that channel that jumped over to join me. I appreciate the support. I look forward to many, many more months, weeks, years, I hope, of doing this with you guys. I'm pushing myself every day to try to be a better person, a better crocheter, a better friend, a better mother, just a better general person all the way around. I mean, I don't know what else I could do on here to, to try to get subscribers except be patient, keep doing what I'm doing, putting up blankets, putting up tutorials, putting up the scarves I do. Any projects that I do, I want to share with all of you. As I said, I'm a left-handed crocheter, strictly left-handed. I don't do right hand at all. I've tried. I've tried to make myself do it. My right hand just does not concept how to do like my left hand does. I've always been told that left-handed people are always in their right mind. <laughs> I truly, fairly blame that. <laughs> um, anyway. Um, I do have a couple more projects started now that this baby blanket is done. I actually have three whips going. Um, one is with the Hirschner's uh, Premier Puzzle Yarn, the Domino's color. I am working on a blanket with that. I do have a baby hat, baby beanie. Also started to go with this blanket. It will be in blue and white as well. And I also have a scarf going with a stitch tutorial or stitch pattern from uh, Bag O'Day Crochet Crystal over there. She makes beautiful scarves, so I am working on a scarf with one of her patterns. Um, I'm, I'm trying it in that blue-purple color of yarn that I had showed you that I, on a Timu yarn review that I did. I'm gonna try it in that. If I can't, I mean, I can do it, but if it doesn't come out like I'm hoping, then I'll just frog that and do it with the Sea Coral Red Heart Ombre um, yarn that I have. So that's what I am up to. When I get my whips a little bit farther, 
along, I can share those with you as well. I do appreciate the feedback from the people that did um, comment on which border and what hooks that they like. I appreciate all of the support from you guys. I just can't express that enough, how much this means to me and how much I want to become one of the YouTube junkies like everybody else, I guess I should say. I, I'm not junkies, but I just want to be hopefully one day as good as Pinky Hooks, Juan the Yarn Addict, Crystal at Bag of Day Crochet, Dee's Creative Hands, Thrift and Stitches. I, the list goes on and on and on and on. I I can't say everybody because I there's too many to say. So, anyway, I just wanted to jump on, thank everybody for their support, show you my finished object that I had showed you guys yesterday of it being almost done. I hope you guys all have a beautiful and blessed Sunday. Today is Sunday, January 7th, I believe. So, I hope you guys have a great day. Be safe, and until next time, keep crocheting. Bye, friends.